Well, tonight we're learning about an alleged cruel scheme to target the late comic book icon Stan Lee. His former business manager is under arrest, accused of elder abuse and theft. Keiko 9's Jeff Nguyen is live in Hollywood with more on the arrest and also fan reaction to it as well. Good evening, Jeff. And good evening to you, Chris and Sarah. You know, if you walk through Hollywood, you are quickly reminded of the lasting impact of Stan Lee. That is a billboard for the upcoming X-Men movie, which is based on his superhero characters. But tonight, police say the real-life villain is his former business partner and caretaker. This is the photo of Kia Morgan. The LAPD is sharing of his arrest in Arizona. His hands are cuffed behind his back as he stands accused of elder abuse against comic icon Stan Lee, who died last November. One look at William Scott's shirt, and you can quickly see why the victim in this case, Stan Lee, who created characters like Spider Man, Black Panther, Iron Man, and many others, had a huge impact on Scott's life. In, in my personal, like, historic value, he's very much up there. Police say Morgan stole nearly $300,000 from Lee by taking money that was earned during autograph signing sessions last May. Morgan had been Lee's former business partner and caretaker. Earlier this month, the L.A. County District Attorney's Office issued a warrant for his arrest. Captain Lillian Carranza runs the LAPD's Commercial Crimes Division. She says Morgan was active on this Twitter account when he was on the run. I sent him a direct uh, message. I was hoping that he would uh, do the right thing and uh, turn himself in. But that didn't happen. Investigators aren't revealing how they tracked him down, but they also say Morgan used his influence to deceive Lee into thinking he was in danger and removed him from his own home in June of last year. Captain Carranza says it's not just families of famous people with a $50 million fortune like Stan Lee who should watch out. This could happen to me, could happen to you. Morgan's attorney says he never abused or took advantage of Lee, while fans like William Scott say Lee's legacy may be a valuable lesson. It's going to be something that I need to be well aware of come these next couple of years uh, when my parents will be within that age where that caretaker will come into effect, and that's something I should be well, uh, you know, on top of. Kia Morgan is expected to go before a judge in Arizona sometime after Memorial Day. That's when he can decide whether or not he will fight extradition to Los Angeles. His bail has been set at $300,000. We're live in Hollywood. Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News.